I'm Dr. Alveda King, Director of African American Outreach for Priests for Life, Activating Civil Rights for the Unborn. And that could be the number 4, T-H-E, or F-O-R, for the unborn. It's very important for us to regard the rights of the unborn as we are talking about issues and concerns and things that are impacting the African American community, but every community in the United States and around the world. Uh, we had a pretty big controversy in the year of 2016 uh, surrounding uh, an activity called the Oscars. Uh, in the movies in Hollywood, they give this gold statue to those movie makers and producers and film people and actors and all of that who appear on what's called the big screen. Of course, now they can appear on one of these little screens too, but they get the Oscars, you know, that award. And so sometimes in this year, 2016, is one of those years when they are recognizing the board of Oscar uh, nominators, they uh, left out the African-American community. There are no really big awards being considered for African-American actors or producers and directors and et cetera. And so the African-American community is like, you left us out again. And I believe that when we talk about equality and who gets awards and that kind of things. For me, civil rights, and those that would be a civil rights question, of course. You don't want to leave out any segment of your population that is contributing. But civil rights actually begins in the womb from conception. The, the little babies, civil rights for the little babies in the womb as well. And they want to be born too, and they can grow up to become actors and get Oscars and all of that. So I just wanted to give us a perspective as we're fighting to be recognized for being on the big screen, what about the camera in the womb? So I want to remind you that as you're doing that, resolve them as my uncle Martin Luther King Jr. would have said, my dad's his brother, Reverend A.D. King, they live in heaven together now. But they would encourage us to get to the discussion tables to resolve these issues peacefully. And so if you've been upset about the Oscars as you're watching this, pray first. Uh, boycotts on Hollywood, that's a possibility. But we want to begin to see each other as brothers and sisters. Acts 17, 26 says, of one blood, God made all people. My uncle ML said, we must learn to live together as brothers, and I add, as sisters, or perish as fools. So as we're learning to live together and work together, celebrate together, recognize together the accomplishments of human beings, I pray that I've given you something to think about, the civil rights for the unborn as well.